And I have a feeling we are about to see a classic in the making here. I'm going to tell you right now, don't get up. Don't leave your chair. If you don't have something to drink, don't worry about it because if you leave, you're going to miss something. Something that's going to be trending on Twitter tomorrow. Sit back. Watch this match. There's nothing these two can't do. They have tremendous physical gifts. They have no fear. They're going to put it all on the line tonight here at Deuces is Wild. John Vandegrift has really reinvented himself. He's changed his physical look. He's changed his mental outlook. Standoff here, and I gotta say, that's one of the quickest feeling out processes I've ever seen. First time ever match here, they came, they made eye contact for the first time in the ring. They touched for the first time ever in the ring, and now things have already yeah, they, escalated. They may have looked and touched for the first time, but I'm guarantee you they've both done a lot of studying on each other. Because when you come to a high profile match like this, you don't come in unprepared. You come in with all your guns ablazing. Vandegrift, as Bailey collide in the ring. Same position Bailey was in about seven years ago. Uh, it's kind of where Vandegrift is now breaking out on the independent scene, going into different regions, making a name for himself. Uh -oh. Oh. But Bailey strikes first. Gentlemen's agreement, it looked like, I guess that backhand spring by Bailey. Goes up, Vandegrift goes over. Off the ropes go Van goes Vandegrift, who hits the arm drag. Drop kick sends Bailey to the outside. Not a safe haven to be against Matt Vandegrift. Bailey the back of the ring oh, wow. levels Vandegrift. Fourth degree black belt in Taekwondo. Look, once you get over second degree, you know what that just means? I'm dangerous as hell. Yeah. Very dangerous, man. Now, running in our uh, our uh, ramp here. And where's, where's Speedball going? I mean, Speedball can pretty much call his own shot now, man. Where's Speedball going? In a lot of pain. Oh! oh! Leaping down two levels to deliver those knees to the midsection. And he's very, he's very, he's, 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 if you watch Speedball, He's dangerous with those knees. He can hit them off the top rope. He can hit them out of a, a, a 450. He is dangerous putting raining those knees down on you. And now just walking over Vandegrift almost to say, not quite at my level, dude. And Vandegrift should take this time here to take this count all the way up to nine before he gets back in the ring because he's in a lot of trouble right now. And he's going to need every second he can get to recover. Vandegrift yeah. back in at seven. Bailey brings him up by the hair. And what a kick. I think Bailey knew he wasn't going to get the win there. He just wanted to let Vandegrift know that he's not going to let up. And he's constantly going to be trying to go for the win. But that's what you do. You send messages constantly in wrestling. Letting him know, I'm not dead, I, I'm not done. I can still go, let's see what you got. Vandegrift gets sent down by Bailey. He springs up and hits and the knees again. Again. I told you, he loves those knee strikes. Do a lot of different things, Mike Bailey. We mentioned unorthodox, unique, however you want to phrase it. He has a way to hit you with a strike from any position, whether he's mid-air or whether he's grounded. You know, I'll go back to what you're saying. I know that I'm unique. Let's just call it special. Yeah. Let's just call it special. What, special. He does, what he does in the ring is just special. He's been successful everywhere he's gone, whether it's North America, Japan, Europe. Worldwide, wrestling fans know the name Mike Bailey, but Vandegrift wants to make sure after tonight, wrestling fans around the world 
know the name Matt Vandergriff. Well, can I can I go and be presumptuous enough to say that maybe Mike Bailey is a modern day Rob Van Dam? Yeah, that's fair. Tierras. Axe kick. Oh! What the hell? Corkscrew through the air gets a two count on Vandegrift. I, mean, I said there's a lot of ways this match could go. It could go to the air, it could become a strike battle. The one thing you knew it going in was you're going to see a lot of things you may have never seen before. It was going to be unique. It was going to be a unique platform and a unique presentation. And the one thing I know about these two is their goal is not only to just win this match, but it's to steal the whole damn show. Steal the show and be the name that stands out. And on a loaded show like this, that's difficult, but that's not going to stop Vandergriff. Vandergriff had a classic the last time we were on Fight TV against Chris Bay. Came up short on that evening, but his whole goal is to get in the ring with these top stars to make sure they realize he's nipping at their heels and he's going to be at their level to be set in the same breath as them. You know, they say there's no such thing as moral victories. Well, I call BS because I think if you go out there and you show yourself, even in defeat, you can get over and you can go over. Oh, look at Vandegrip brings him into the corner. Tiger Fiend kick. Vandegrift now showing off his offense, and he's going to go high risk. Up to the top row. Bailey played a little bit of possum. Put the ankles there, put the rope. Caused Vandegrift to, to lose his footing. Yeah, he lured him in. You can hear that thud, and we are some 50, 60 feet away from the ring. And I can feel that four. You only had to fear a little taste. Imagine being on the receiving end. That's the point. Dishing out these shots. They've locked hands. Nowhere for the other man to go. Bailey goes down. Sent off again. Lands on his feet this time. Top rope drop kick. Not a great landing for Vandegrift, but that allows it to cause more force. And Vandegrift feeling it now. Uh oh. And Bailey wants to put a stop to the. And that. Bailey, he can fly. Bailey can fly. Drop kick through the ropes. Bailey's already caused a lot of damage to Vandegrift on the outside. But Speedball lets his guard down. And Speedball went to pan to the crowd. And, you know, not all the time that doesn't work. So sometimes you got to pay attention. Vandergriff in the ring. You know, Speedball kicks him right back out. Where's Speedball going? Second rope. Asahi Muso. And he's cleared a rope to do that. Cleared a rope, but he targeted Vandergriff, who's in a lot of trouble. And Speedball wants to go back up top. Vandergriff with a kick to the throat. Uh, oh, oh, he's Vandergriff. He's turned backwards. That's Moonsault position! Not a risk on earth. Vandergriff isn't willing to take. Hits the Oriahara Moonsault. And both men on the outside. Not in a good position. So much going down between these two. Vandegrift made it known on social media that he was looking forward to this match. He's already competed against a lot of great competitors, but in his mind, Mike Bailey might have been the greatest he stepped in the ring with in 2022. Count it to seven. And Vandegrift gets Bailey back in the ring, but Bailey rolls back out to the outside. Ah. 
both men got to use the ropes to get back to a standing position. Goodness gracious. Danny Griff wants another shot. Danny Griff not able to stay standing after that one. Yeah, that one really rocked Danny Griff. Can he can retaliate? Okay. There it is. And that one knocked Bailey for a loop. They just want to see who's the tougher man now. Strike for strike. Oh, Bailey come with kicks. Yeah, that's the one thing Vanegar might not be able to do. His match kicks with Bailey. Oh, as good as Vanegar's kicks are. Yeah, he had to put a stop to that. Swatting away with those chops. Oh, turn Bailey around. Oh God, he tripped him up. Oh, oh my goodness! Missed! Missed the Ultimo weapon. And now Vandegraaff knows he can't get the win there, but he can do the damage he needs. A lot of damage being done on the apron of the ring. Now Vandegraaff coming in, going back to the top. Vandegrift so dangerous upstairs. Got him, splash, cover! No, cover! Goes for the cover that time, but Bailey so resilient. Now Vandegrift attacking that ankle again. And it's very smart to take the ankle away from Bailey. He kept, most of his offense is about his base. It's his leg strikes. It's his launching into his knees. He needs his ankle to create that upward force. And he needs it, and that's why, as you mentioned, Vanegrift's gonna try to take away every strength Bailey has. But Speedball gets some rallying behind him, reaches the ropes, he's gonna force Vandegrift to break. But in those bare feet, when you get locked in a submission, like an ankle lock, it's extra dangerous. Yeah, if you have boots on, you have a little extra protection because the boot can only bend so much. If you have no boots on, it is all ankle being twisted. Next to the back of the head, Vandegrift staggered. Oh, and now he's going for it here. Bailey going again for the miss. Vandegrift has that move scouted. Oh, oh, machine gun kicks. Step up, Enziguri. What a flurry from Mike Bailey. Speedball, oh, he dodges, dodges the penalty kick. German suplex holds on. And gets the two. Vandegrift held on to that because he wanted to be, that to be the deciding move in this match. But it doesn't get Speedball. No matter what you think, in some match you're like, okay, I've had enough, let's end this. Let me just get out of here. And that's what Vandegrift was trying to do. He was trying to end the match at that point. Look at Vandegriff setting up for a Styles clash. Bailey doing everything he can to fight out of that. He knows it's only so much more trauma his body can take in this match before it shuts down. Oh, Vandegriff! Great counter! Back and forth they go. Penalty kick connects. Ultimo weapon! Buzzsaw kicked to the head. No! And again, those kicks from Bailey, that background, that black belt in Taekwondo, makes his kicks so much more lethal than your average wrestler, whose kicks could probably knock out most everybody. Crowd really get behind Bailey on Vandegrift's home turf. I think the fans have such a high level of respect to both wrestlers. Well, at, well, this, at this point, I think fans see just a good match and they see great wrestling and they get behind both guys.
Definite competitive spirit here tonight. Look at Bailey, gets caught. Vandergriff gets that ankle again. Ankle lock in. Is that a heel hook or an ankle lock? Can't tell my position. Well, he has target at the ankle. Now he's trying to switch it up a little. But Bailey had the ropes for a second. Counters it. No. Oh, look at Vandergriff. Got up top, but he got caught by Bailey with the kick. Bailey up high. Franken, Eric and Rana. Roll through. Into a Styles Clash. Yes. Got him. Is that going to be enough to put away Bailey? No. And Vandegrift immediately doesn't get the victory and decides it's time to go high risk. And you can see Vandegrift climbing up top. 450, no. Vandegrift changed his trajectory in midair so he wouldn't crash and burn. But Bailey was able to capitalize. Got and him! This could do it here. Got it him. does. What a matchup!